Alright, so today, guys, is the day where I'm leaving for Camp America. I've actually got to get the train from Liverpool to London, Houston, Houston to Heathrow Airport, and then I've got to wait until um, the morning because it's about 9 o'clock now, and my flight is at 9 in the morning. So I'm going to be staying overnight in the airport. But yeah, I've got a long journey ahead of me, and I've got my stuff packed. But yeah, the most important thing is actually my bag of food. You know, I love my food. Oh, ready to leave. The only things about these trains is just so hot. There's and trains you need to turn the heating down. Guys, this is like the deadest train I've ever been on. Literally, I've just plonked my, all of my stuff, <coughs> as usual. My messy self, and there's like nobody on this train. One guy there, and one guy. No, two people over there. Let's go and have a look around. Guys, I'm kind of lost, but I need to get the train to Green Park and then a change to get to Heathrow, something like that. Right, guys, I made this to the airport finally, just travelling on this slow thing to Terminal 3 now. So, yeah, I need to um, make my way over. I'll let you know when I'm in the area. Well, just like that, guys, I made it to Terminal 3, and the time is. Half past one in the morning. The airport is dead. There's no one here. Right, I spoke to the security slash police. They said I can go to like one of the coffee shops that are open if I want or just sit anywhere really. Time is now half five exactly. I've got half an hour to check it. Right guys, I'm on the move again. I'm gonna try and go down to check in now. This is my first time traveling alone, to be honest. That's my first time traveling for a while as well, but you've got these machines. You have to get your boarding pass all by yourself, type everything in, and it's a long process, and my thing wasn't working, so, yeah. And now, I've got to do a bag drop. Right, all checked in. Got my boarding pass ready. Suitcases all checked in as well, so. And for security, here's a top tip for you. Keep all your liquids. 150 mil in a bag before you get to the airport so that you know what you're gonna take. This is security now. Oof. I made a few security, but it gave me a pretty tough time. I had to take my shoes off, my jacket off, everything for inspection. I had to go through a special body scanner. <laughs> I've made some friends. We've got Elliot, Jacob, Hey! Nikki. Nikki and Neve. me. Oh, these, yeah, he's got the middle seat. Decent's got a window seat. Oh, look, we're squished. <laughs> With a view of the wing. I'm just gonna have something sweet, me. We're in a massive queue. It's like one of those queues you have in like Alton Towers. Yeah, we're making like half an hour. Almost done now. To go into that pod thing there, an extra interview <laughs> separated from this crowd. I think I'm going to the main pit part where to get my suitcase now. Baggage claim now, so I need to find my suitcase. Found it, guys. I've just been waiting on that scale. I've seen anything for ages. It was here on the floor the whole time. Right, we need to find Camp America stuff. <laughs> I feel like we just lost. Oh, look, there's someone there. <laughs> yes. I've been waiting here for like an hour. Hey. Finally, we're making our way out of the airport. <laughs> Coach, that one on. Flashback to the time in your life when you thought it would be easy, but it's hard when you take on the world alone. 
guys, we made it to the hotel. It's called Double Tree by Hilton. Oh, what's up? It's going. Yes. Beds, nice little TV, the cupboard, and the toilet. Yeah. So this is our place for the for the night. And I think I'm gonna go and check out the gym now. As we made it to the gym, obviously you must think we're a bit mad coming to the gym when we've just travelled, but obviously, you know, gotta get it. One shot that you fire at the sky, hoping someone else can see it. Just a sign that you're not at the wrong you want. So we've got a quick workout done in the gym. Only a few exercises. Sometimes it's just better to do a quick one to feel better, feel good, and then drink some water and get a good mindset. Experience and target, guys. <laughs> it's kind of dead, isn't it? Supposed to be more busy. Oh, kick out. Well, the entrance, the, en the entrance is there, and the exit is like on the other side. I'm confused, me. What did you think of Target then? Uh, what did I think of Target? Yeah, it's good. It's just it was so it was kind of dead, wasn't it? Like it wasn't. I I wasn't impressed. JJ, any opinions, man? <laughs> I mean, it's got it's got everything you want. It, it's so big that you just kind of can't be asked to look through it properly. Yeah, I, I'm not. I ain't feeling Target. Hopefully, Walmart will be uh, will be better for us. How's your day been? It's been really fun. I'm joking. It's been really tiring. We're all struggling with accents because God knows what he says. But are you are you looking forward though to like tomorrow at least when you uh, yeah. not the waking up but like you know actually getting to the real camp now and. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Say good night to the people. Night. It's the end of the day. You can see it's actually night time now. I'm gonna go to sleep in a few minutes, and yeah, it's been a decent day. To be honest, we haven't really done much. All we've been able to do is basically go to JFK Airport, get our stuff, come here to the hotel, explore a little bit around here. But there isn't much to do. We've got some food to eat. Walked around a little bit. In the morning, we've got to have our breakfast, and then at different times, depending on what camp you're in, because there's like over 60 of us staying in this hotel. I'm looking forward to getting to camp, but I think I'll end this video right here because we've uh, made it to the hotel, and then I'll, I'll start a new fresh video tomorrow. So, yeah, thank you all very much for watching. I hope that me showing you all the journey getting to the airport and all that, all the messing about, hopefully, it helped you in some way. I'll see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching, and peace.